Hey guys, how you doing? How you doing? This is Santos here, guys. Nothing. I'm just want to show you guys a few holes here. For example, we're gonna go now for hole number one in the Pacific Cup tournament. And in this hole, I'm going to be using an extra mile seven with a berserker, and I'm gonna be doing a full tot spin, full less spin, and then like like about half of the red ring you know and uh going through the rough on the left as you could see there basically like half of the red ring and then adjust three rings in this shot i'm not doing any elevation guys no elevation at all so it should have been like 3.3 .3, but i just did three rings one thing I want to show you, and the reason I'm showing you this is because I, I did you just a slide over power here just to see how the ball will react and how much OP I will need in this adjustment. As you can see there, we end up in the bunker. So we need to do in this hole, guys, even using a berserker, we need like about 50% of overpower. We need that. So remember that. You need about 50%. You don't need full OP, but you do need 50% of overpower in the shot with the Berserker. So we can have a really nice bounce into the second fairway. We still manage to you know using the Malibu here. We can still get the ego, obviously. Um, you don't want to be in that position because you need to hit a perfect in order to get the ego here we still managed to get the ego but i mean the idea is that you guys don't go in through that so and that's how we did hole number one and now now for hole number six guys this is a hole that i really like because i f i feel very confident in this hole i'm not saying that i might go in all the time but doing the adjustment is all about the adjustment. Okay, so here I'm going to use a katana full top spin and about five bars of less spin here. And then as you can see, my second bounce just gonna be at the edge of the rough into the second fairway. You can call it that way. Just at the edge, as you can see there, then adjust your win with 10% downhill extra that you need to do this it's better to hit it perfect because you don't want to be close into the rough there but you see and it's very important that you write your yardage here 362 yards guys that means that we're going to be playing with the goliath 7 and this shot the reason i love it is because you need to do is one top spin one last spin guys that's what you need and then as you saw there we're not going to be a max but we ain't a mid distance either so what is the saying that we are between max and mid so for 5.9 is 3.4 rings but in this case since i'm not a max i'm going to adjust only only three rings three rings because i am between max and mid and then look how nice the ball will come and will roll and then boom get the albatross here all you gotta do guys is just understand how much is your mileage i mean how much is your yardage for that hole in hole number six and that's how you can get the albatross in there using also 10 percent guys 10 percent extra in your second shot as for hole number nine guys i'm using the quarterback nine red ring at the edge of the rough and then guys one thing you got to be careful here is that i'm using minus 10 percent uphill in this shot so all i did was i only had from 5.6 i only adjusted five rings that's all full curl just use like a slight overpower and full cut spin because you want to get as much distance possible with your drive here 
and uh, with headwind that's what we need you know we need to get as much yardage as possible and then we end up with 332 yards but now you're gonna see the second shot I'm gonna be using the sniper 8 sniper 8 and then with the second shot guys we are gonna have headwind as well so this is gonna be a tough shot so for me just in case at least to ensure your ego here guys if you want to use your big dog or cataclysm it will be the best option in my opinion but if you have like a sniper 9 or 10 you can also do it but you need to gain as much distance as possible so i did adjust my win you know like i did one to one here as you saw there then i have to use full overpower because you know you don't want to you know hit the rough and then you know miss your shit. you see how close i end up with my second bounce i mean with my first my first bound how close i was to the edge of the butt with to the rough but with the sniper nine but with the sniper nine guys um or ten you should be you're still gonna use overpower, but you still be should be fine with their shot. But you know, my best advice will be like, don't risk it. If you want to have a sh safe eagle, go with a cataclysm with a big dog. But if you want to go with the sniper, you can still do it with sniper nine or ten, but get as much possible distance with your drive. Nothing, guys. Those um, other shots. I hope it will help. I will help you and go through your round. All right. So take care. Have a blessed day. And uh, good luck in your round. Bye bye, guys.